into our trip got about another hour to go it's only going to take about two hours in total to get there which is a lot better than the three and a half the GPS was telling Meta I'm guessing she was doing something wrong because when I plugged the address in it was right and it only said hour and a half two hours total whatever that says it all I guess so, yes, we're still driving. Time to get the donkey poodles! It's a boring drive. It's not boring. They're going to pick up donkey poodles. Oh, but the drive itself is boring. I'm the driver, I'm fine. It's nice, it's beautiful scenery. We're going to get donkey poodles. Mm. How can it Don not be good? Donkey poodles. Yes. So where do they get the name Donkey Poodle from? Well, they're, they're there to guard the flocks and donkeys traditionally are a good flock protector. Okay. Yeah. So, and a poodle is like a dog and a dog is a guard dog, so Donkey Poodle. They got curly hair most of them. They have like right. a crimped hair. So they got like poodle hair. So donkey poodles. And it was off the Arms family homestead. Where they come up with the name. Yeah. So thank you, Arms Family Homestead. <laughs> Check them out, they're on yeah. YouTube. You've now called our donkey poodles donkey poodles. They do have names though, it is Bruno and Molly, but you'll get introduced to them when we get to them. So yeah, Bruno and Molly, we'll, we'll, um, we'll chuck them on camera when we get the, when you get there and... Hello dog. Come in. Hello. And that's Molly. And you must be Bruno. He loves lying near the water and sticking her head in the water. Sticking her head in the water. She's always wet on her Hello, Bruno. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, that's beautiful. So they've both been hold the train. Yeah. But they haven't been on hold for a while. We, don't yeah. do, we usually do it now only when we um, go to give them vaccinations or... Because <laughs> we used to walk them around and they're going and all that. Um, and he was quite good. 
put in the ring, this boy, but then we wedded him because we didn't need another stud man. Yeah. And she's just always been a breeding female for us, yeah. Molly. Yeah, I thought she's had a, uh, yeah, some, are they Korea? Yeah, yeah, yeah Korea, yeah, 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 she's had a few. Yeah. Only about three or four, mm -hmm. she? yeah. um, but she's quite thin at the moment. Mm. So she probably wouldn't mind a bit of um, horse and pony pellets or something, yeah, which we yeah. don't have anymore at the moment. Either. No, no worries, we've got some so, loosen in the trailer. Yeah, I'll loosen some of them. I think you'll find whatever you feed the goat. Yeah, don't leave. Yeah. 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 There's three, that's the baby baby one, isn't it? They get spoiled. Shoot that, she'll come up and eat out of your hand. Yeah. Molly. Yeah. Very friendly. And, um, you watching, dear? Yep. <laughs> it's quite easy. You, alpacas, have you got any alpacas? No. This is the first. They, they just don't like being, um, uh, they don't like it if you come head on to them. Yeah. They don't like it if you try to pat them like a dog, you know, like yeah, come like with your the face. Yeah, yeah. They like it, they're better come from if, the side. Yeah, if you come from the side, it's much easier Very to pat them. Very similar to, yeah, to yeah. the goats as well. Yeah. Leave my horns alone, not dogs. And yeah. yeah, so they're like that. And, and, and we're heading back home. You can't see them because we're um, they're in the trailer back there, obviously. But anything you want to say? It was an interesting beginning. Um, Bruno went on the trailer reasonably easy. Molly, on the other hand, um, was a little bit defiant. Um, decided she'd lay down in the shed and that's where she was going to stay. <laughs> yeah, um, Molly's a very stubborn alpaca. Yes. Uh, was it a, um, a doodle donkey, a uh, poodle donkey? A donkey, a donkey poodle. Donkey poodle. Donkey poodle. She's a very stubborn donkey poodle. Yes. So, yeah. It was a case of picking her up and placing her in the trailer. Was that divide? Yeah, it was. She's heavy. We had to pick her up, um, but that's all right. You know, we got the job done. Onwards and upwards, I guess. Yes. And now to do the two-hour drive home and and get them unloaded, and we can get this trailer back to to the hire shop. Alrighty, I'll uh, update later. We've got 189 kilometres till home. Bye for now. Adios. Two thousand years later. Okay, so what we've done, I've just reversed up to the gate here. We got the gate and the, the trailer. I've just reversed it so we can get the ramp down and just put the ramp down to here. And um, yeah, then we'll open up the gate and let them in. Which way are you going, Molly? 
She's like, I don't know about this place. Hey, Carmel. Hello, Molly. I'll get used to the herd. And they'll all become friends. And now I've got to clean up the, the wee and poo from the car track. And you guys can watch. Okay, so we can get the trailer back before close of business now. And see how Meta's going with, with the, the alpacas. Can't really see from here, but... There are hoses. This one. That's the middle, that's the bottom, bottom, middle, top, and that's the deck. It allows us to have four hoses running off the one thingy. Turn the tap off as well? Yeah, I turned the tap off as well. I did not. Oh, I definitely did. Not. I know I did. Not. I did. Not. See, I told you I did it. I told you hadn't done it. <sighs> you shouldn't, because I did not do it. There they are down there. They've been rolling in the mud already. I think they're going to have fun. Oh God, she's completely muddy. She's like a... Donkey She's like a top deck chocolate. <laughs> we haven't posted much lately. I mean, there's been a few other issues. It's the reason why we lost prints. 
and um, yeah, we just we lost Prince, and the Christmas period happened, and <clears throat> and then after that, it was just one thing onto another. It was hectic. I worked right through. I didn't get a Christmas break. I didn't get to go do anything exciting down Melbourne when Meta went down to see her family. I was under the pump. I need to get some certain jobs done before Christmas time, which I got them done on Christmas Day. <clears throat> well, one out of the one out of the five. One had a few other complications that needed to be dealt with, and then it'll get there. I'm only one person after all. It's hard to do five things at once, especially over Christmas from 21st, 22nd, 23rd, 24th. 25th and 26th I did 12 hour days so it's not fun we're about to get ready to go and take the trailer back oh that shade is good oh that's awesome and a nice breeze too a bit of flyover action but what are we doing are we I thought you'd just want to watch them for a bit, just in case anything happened, and and just watch them just for a bit. Oh. It's just so hot.